the Silverado and Sierra, both based on the GMT 910 platform, are stars among heavy-duty pickups. Admittedly, the Ford and Dodge offerings are also strong performers, but there's no good reason not to look at these when buying a pre-owned 3 fourths or 1-ton truck. Since both Chevrolet and GMC brands are virtually identical in terms of engines, options, equipment, and talents, the decision for buying one over the other might just boil down to availability or preference. There could be a sweet Chevy example for sale 50 miles away, but a comparable GMC truck a couple of miles down the road. The 2500 HD versions come with regular, extended, and crew cabs. The extended cab has rear hinged back doors that open out 170 degrees. Long, 8.2 feet, beds are offered with any cab, but extended and crew variants can come with the regular, 6.6 .6 feet, bed. Gasoline fueled propulsion comes from a 6.0 liters V8 developing 353 horsepower and 373 pounds to foot of torque. Output rose to 360 horsepower and 380 pounds to foot in 2010. Also, there's the turbocharged 6.6 liters V8 Duramax diesel, good for 365 horsepower and 660 pounds to foot. A new Duramax debuted in 2011, making 397 horsepower and a considerable 765 pounds to foot. A buy fuel option for the 6.0 liters V8 was available for 2013, offering the choice of gasoline or compressed natural gas (CNG). However, Output dips to 301 horsepower and 333 pounds to foot while running on CNG. All versions come with a 6-speed automatic transmission. The diesel truck has a beefed-up Allison unit, the gasoline truck's trans is no whim, though, and features a manual shift option. Rear-wheel drive is standard, four-wheel drive is optional. The newer diesel engine is paired with an Allison 1000 transmission, a combination claims to improve fuel economy and emissions by 11% over earlier versions.